Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the Journey YouTube channel. This is I, I do it again. Now, this video is gonna be about meditation and like, I'm gonna explain what meditation is and how to meditate and all of that. The meditation is, a, is actually just conscious breathing, just being conscious of the breath, the in and out, you know, the push and the pull, the yin and the yang. So the pull, the push. That's meditation. So you don't actually have to close your eyes to meditate. You can just be conscious of the breathing, just the breath work. That is meditation. So you don't have to actually sit down and close your eyes for hours and all that. It's not that. Meditation can just can be even just a minute out of your day. Five minutes. You know, it's not a thing where you have to like put a lot of pressure on. You know. Do what you can. You just Meditation can be done as I said, closing your eyes and just being conscious of the breath work. Just the push and the pull, the in and the out, the inhaling and the exhaling. Just be conscious of it and take deep breaths, deep inhalation and deep exhale <laughs> and deep exhalation, whatever it is. You know, so a deep breath and in and a deep breath out. And you realize say, your mind become more clear, your body starts to feel better and all of that. So that is meditation. Alright, why meditate? Meditate simple. You always are meditate because you always are breathe. But for always are take deep breaths, for always are you know we're supposed to always are meditate. It's just the way we live. You can do maybe you can go them say you can go 14 days without food and maybe whatever them you you know the statistics. They say you can maybe go 30 days without food and 14 days without water. But how long can you go without taking a breath, you know, taking a deep breath <laughs> or taking just the breath of life? You maybe can go 30, 30, 30 minutes like divers. I think some divers can go 30 minutes without, you know, like dive 30 minutes without getting fresh air. But that's the most. You can go a day without breathing and that's just the importance of breathing and it's an art. The art of deep breathing is what is called meditation. So. I think we need to get ourselves more, you know, into meditation. And as I said, you always are meditate. So even if you just start take deep breaths for like 10 seconds, that is meditation. Because you always are breathe. <laughs> so just be conscious of the breathing and that you start meditate naturally. Alright, so types of meditation. So you can close your eyes and go into the position like we see the guru them like crossing your legs and all of that like the yogic, the yogic position and that's like the most common way of meditation and most people focus better when they close their eyes so you can do it that way by closing your eyes and taking deep breaths and just, just focus on the breath work, that's it just focus on the inhaling and the exhaling and that's meditation that's it, you don't have to close your eyes and say what you want to know something or read a certain you know there's no goal in meditation just focus on the breath work and while you focus on the breath work you find the downloads that to come your mind become more clear you start become more aware of yourself you know the higher self and start to become more connected to what you're supposed to be doing your life purpose what you're supposed to be doing in this lifetime and all of that but the more you practice meditation is the more your mind open up and you connect the higher self more and you know just become more aware of the spiritual aspect of life that's all <laughs> meditation really gives you it relieves you of anxiety it relieves you of depression it relieves you of time because you're not all on the time anymore because the moment you inhale and exhale that's you releasing time so that means you have no anxiety because you're not holding on to time anymore you are just being, simply being. And as I said, you can you, you can do meditation by um closing your eyes and going in a yogic position. You can simply just sit down in a chair and stare at like a plant or stare in nature. And that's also meditation. Just focus on one thing. On nature, something peaceful, or something peaceful. You cannot meditate in noise, <laughs> you know. So if you ever try to meditate in a night, it does not work. Because meditation is something where you're supposed to like bring it bring yourself in a calmer mode, you know? A more peaceful and serene mode. 
They can say they at the party and I try to meditate. <laughs> they can say they at church and I try to meditate. You just can't have them church. Most churches are just very nice with the drums and the singing and all that. So there is no meditation in the church. This is why I am highly against the Christian church. Most of them, because most of them all them girls make nice. They find it a lot of hooligans just there. They are just a bit very nice. And it's like, you know? Some people even say church boring because it's too white. So they want to hear nice and they cannot connect to God. It's nice, it's simple. So the, most, so the easiest way for you to connect to the most I is to sit still with yourself and meditate. When you're in a meditative mode, that's it. And when you're in a meditative mode, believe me, you clear yourself of anxiety and depression. And when you're not anxious anymore, you will get answers. You will get answers. So, don't do it solely for answers, you know, do it and develop a certain, develop it, use it for develop, for, use it for develop yourself and make it into a practice. Because the more you make it into a practice and the more your brain will start to slow down. So you see me I say, you're not anxious anymore, you're not always overthinking. If you have a problem with overthinking, meditation will help you a lot. Because you just bring yourself to a calm and enjoy the present moment. And the more you enjoy the present moment, you find the anxiety disappear, depression disappear, you know. So that's what they really get from meditation. The primary reasons why you're supposed to meditate. Don't be faith, just achieve a higher state of consciousness. Don't be don't make that be the goal. Just make be make being in the present moment be the goal. Make being in the present moment be the goal of meditation at all times. And with that you achieve everything else because it, you really enjoy yourself try to be peaceful and when you be peaceful you attract a lot more things you attract information from the cosmos <laughs> you get the message so that is about meditation as i said you don't have to close your eyes to meditate you know in the beginning to focus more you close your eyes that's the only if you need to close your eyes you close your eyes but you really don't need to close your eyes to meditate you don't even have to sit to meditate you can stand up and meditate as i just said meditation is conscious breathing it's just the breath work, you're focusing on the breath work. And that is meditation. So get yourself more into meditation. And you can lay down on your back in your bed and meditate. You can lay down on your belly and meditate. You know, you don't have to be sitting in the yogic position to meditate, you know. <laughs> meditation is just breath work, conscious breathing. And you can do it sitting at the table. You can do it in the water, you can do it standing up, you can do it laying down, you can, you know, just conscious breathing, that is meditation. So get yourself into more conscious breathing. Take hey, deep breaths, man. I find out that a lot of it is a big problem in today's society. A lot of people don't take deep breaths. They're always anxious, always up on the go. So they don't really get time to take a deep breath. And it's really a bad thing, you know, because most of the anxiety, most of the pain that you feel and all of that, most of the depression comes from just you not breathing properly, believe it or not. So breathing, conscious breathing is a thing where we need to get back to. Just be conscious of the breath, the breath of life, the prana. The prana is the life force, it's found in the air. Just feel that how peaceful you feel, just try it. Yeah, man, so sometimes when you feel anxious and you feel depressed, feel uneasy, just try it. Conscious breathing. Breathing. You can just, as I said, you don't have to close your eyes. You can just, you can just focusing on a, an object, whatever, whatever, whatever object it is. You know, me, I mostly do it in nature. Like, I stare at a tree. I just stare at a tree and I take deep breaths. And that is meditation for me, you know. I used to meditate with closing my eyes. And I still do it sometimes, you know, but I find it better if I just meditate when like, you know, whenever you feel like, say, if you meditate, just start to take some deep breaths in a taxi, in a car, wherever you are, just conscious breathing. Yeah man, so that's about meditation, you know, that's the introduction to meditation from the journey. Big up one of the good YouTube channel. Like, comment, share, subscribe.